Good morning, it's Wednesday, October 4th. Yesterday on October 3rd, the third of the year fixed, hit a new high, the highest rate since 2000. So it's about seven and three quarters right now. So with that happening, all the big guys are changing their projections. The MBA, which is the Mortgage Bankage Association, they said the third of the year fix would be in the fives by the end of the year this year. Now they changed that, that it's gonna be in the sixes through 2024. So I don't know the exact numbers on that. You know, you can look them up. But Goldman Sachs has changed their predictions. In August, they said that it can hit 5.9 uh, in 2024. Now they're saying the revised is 6.8 in 2024. They also predict mortgage origination to be down and purchase origination to be down in 2024. And they say they're just going to be less mortgages in 2024 than there were in 2023. And we know 2023 was very light. This being said, anybody who's been following the numbers like me knows that Golden is wrong a lot of the times. I mean, I guess I shouldn't say wrong, but their projections, they end up changing them and they're not accurate and they don't come to pass. So we're just going to keep tracking it. But what does this mean for all of us? The higher rates are the new normal, okay? The old timers still talk about the 16 and 17% of the Carter years, but that's highly unlikely to happen. The rates in the sevens right now, and maybe if we get down to the sixes, maybe we touch the eights, these are the rates that we're gonna have to get used to, and affordability is way up there. But when I can tell you that out here in Southern California, there are many more buyers and sellers. We have seen the interest rates triple, go from two and a half to seven and a half, and it barely affected the prices of the homes because it's all about supply and demand. There are much more buyers than sellers, and the sellers, they don't wanna sell, they have no place to go. But if you need a house and you can afford the payments, you gotta buy it because we don't know what's gonna happen in the future. What we do know is historically, forever, if you bought a house and you held on to it, you did okay, forever. I have never, never seen somebody saying, I am so sorry that I bought, but I did see plenty of people who said, I'm so sorry that they sold. So I don't see this low inventory environment changing anytime soon. If you have any questions about this, give me a call at 818-917-8890. DM me, instant message me, whatever you want. I'm happy to help.